Hi everybody. So today is just going to be a quick rant. Uh, specifically, I'm going to be ranting about Coinbase. The purpose of this rant is really just to let people know what Coinbase is doing if you use Coinbase. Um, probably mostly people in the US. Uh, but if you use Coinbase, what it is is it is a exchange that allows you to buy certain cryptocurrencies with fiat, which is really useful. Most of the exchanges, it's hard to get fiat in and out. So you can buy Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, and Litecoin. Now, for a while, I've had uh, some Ethereum and some Litecoin, basically, in my Coinbase account. And the other day, when the markets were on a dip, I saw a really good opportunity to do a swap of Litecoin for Steam. And when I went to make the transfer to block trades, uh, they said, waiting to clear. It might take 72 hours. Please upload your ID for faster, for, to accelerate this process, right? And this is a problem. Like it's one thing if you want to buy in or sell the cryptocurrency, they'll lock in the rate for that in dollar amount transfer. But if you're transferring to another wallet in order to swap one coin for another, Block Trades isn't going to hold your rate based on like when they initially quoted you the estimate. They're going to give you whatever it is by the time they receive the Litecoin. So I needed to make the transfer right then and Coinbase wouldn't let me do that. And when I called them, the initial person on the phone, I don't think understood how blockchain technology works at a company that handles cryptocurrency wallets. The person was like, well, it was just taking a while because we had a lot of traffic on the website. That makes no fucking sense. I initiated a transaction. All you have to do is initiate the transaction. The processing is done on the blockchain. It's not done on Coinbase. You're not Visa. You're not Bank of America. You're a fucking wallet. Anyways, um, that was the response they gave me. And when I talked to their supervisor, the supervisor, I guess, did understand a little bit of how blockchain worked, but was not able to give me a better reason than, well, it was a security thing. So we needed to make sure that this was you. And I'm like, well, I uploaded all my ID stuff and that didn't do anything. Point being, my recommendation to you, get any money that you aren't just hodling for dear life. Meaning if you think you're gonna transfer any of your Coinbase coins to another cryptocurrency, not just to dollars and back and forth from dollars to that one cryptocurrency. If you think you're going to do that, get it out of Coinbase as soon as possible and into another exchange because you can't wait 72 hours on some fucking security whim from Coinbase. You would need to do that immediately. So. Right now I'm using Binance, but there's Bittrex and there's a bunch, right? Like there's a ton of other wallets out there that you can use. You can go into cold storage if you really want. My point is get all that coin that you have in Coinbase out of it, unless you're only planning to ever just keep it in Coinbase forever and then sell it one day. That's my, my advice to you. Bit of a rant, I know. Uh, but I think it's just borderline criminal. I get that they want to make sure that everything is secure, but at the same time, it's like, this is literally the system that we're trying to avoid with cryptocurrency. And when you keep somebody's money for 72 hours, that costs people money, maybe a little bit, maybe a whole lot, but it's like percentages, right? Non-negligible percentages of like 10%, 20%. And if it's like a hundred bucks, 10 or 20%, whatever, 10 bucks, 20 bucks, it's annoying, but it's not like crazy money. But if you were trying to make a transfer of a hundred thousand dollars, and that 72 hour window was the difference between 10 and $20,000. That's a huge fucking deal. Anyways, rant over, get your money out of Coinbase. Only use Coinbase to get your dollars into some cryptocurrency. Cool. Follow me for probably fewer rants, but other stuff. I'll talk to you later.